Hi, in this video from tvtrade.ie we're basically going to show you um, how to um, configure your DVR, uh, at least the first step anyway, in um, trying to access your live feed or recordings from a mobile device such as a smartphone, something like this. Okay, So you have two ways you can go about this, you can either use your remote control um, for the DVR or you can use a mouse. Now I have a mouse plugged in so that's what I'm going to use. So if I right click on the screen here and go into main menu, first thing we do is we go to advanced and we want to go to mobile okay so you can set the username as whatever you want and you can set the password as whatever you want so I'm just going to set the password as AABBCC okay you probably want to make it something a bit trickier than that anyway but just for demonstration purposes uh, that's what I'll do and then you just click on apply and it's just saving the settings there okay so at this point you should note this number, this is very important, the server port. So in this case it's 15961. Okay, so you should take note of this at this point and also remember what your username and password was. So I'm just going to exit out of here. The next thing you want to do is go into network. Now what, what you want to make sure is you have your ethernet cable plugged in from your router to your DVR. Okay, you want to make sure the TCP IP uh, type is static. And at that stage then it should, the router should assign you an IP address. In this case it's 192.168.001.223. Okay. Uh, in general, routers will generally assign IP addresses uh, that will either begin with 192 or they'll begin with the number 10. Um, so that will be fine. So that's fine. When that's all done, you can just exit out of there. So they're basically the two things uh, you need to do for the first step in configuring your DVR uh, for access uh, from a mobile device such as a smartphone or tablet.